The 17-year-old William Nib Memorial High School student who killed another student was today sentenced to four years and 10 months behind bars. Earlier this year, he pleaded guilty to manslaughter. Family members of the deceased teen were in court today when the judge handed down the sentence. Anthony Lugg has the details. Disappointment outside the St. James Circuit Court on Monday following the sentencing of the William Nib High School student charged in relation to the stabbing death of fellow student Kamal Hall. We take a life and then four here, eight months, no sir, no fear, but there's nothing we can do. Hall was fatally stabbed at school during a dispute allegedly over a guard ring. In handing down the sentencing, presiding judge Andrea Thomas explained that she took into consideration a number of factors, among them the findings of the psychiatric evaluation, his age, the time spent in custody, and the fact that he pleaded guilty to the offense. I believe him should I get more sentence, you know, but there's nothing I can do. That's what they said, you know, so it was very disappointed anyway. The incident happened in March this year. The deceased teen's family says life has not been the same. I just can't explain. I just can't explain. Because my brother keep being on and out of the hospital because of this. It has not been easy. But God is the ultimate judge after everything. He's the ultimate judge. Since the incident, the Education Ministry has increased measures to address violence and other behavioral problems in schools. Anthony Lug, TVJ News.